Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. Today I am uploading, doing, <laughs> was showing you my first Island Living Inspired video that's going up on this channel. I'm planning on doing at least probably two builds. I don't know if I might do just an Island Inspired Sim as well because today I thought I would make a mermaid because I know a lot of people are excited for mermaids and I actually, apart from skin details and the eyes and the eyebrows, and the makeup <laughs> well apart from her like the face makeup that i give her later but all of that is no cc yeah like, it's all ea stuff that came with the new pack because i can tell you i think the cast objects we well cast clothing and stuff we got is really cute i like the hair a lot like the hair i end up giving her is probably my favorite one the sims has ever done it's just i feel like they're getting a bit better with actually creating stuff that fits the time a bit better <coughs> sorry um if you understand what i mean like it's just a bit more modern something you actually would see and not like super weird hair that you can't really give any of your sims but then i was really excited about all the stuff that they have for adult women sims or female sims but then i went into the guys stuff and there wasn't really that much like let me know what you think if you wish there was a bit more for guys too because i like in the guy cc department like <laughs> i have to admit i always only download female stuff like clothing and hair <clears throat> but rarely anything for my male sims which i don't know why it's probably because i mainly create women so I don't really look for male CC but I wish there would have been more for boys and there's also not that much for kids and toddlers which I always get bummed about because I feel like we don't have enough stuff for our toddlers and kids and I feel like if they already make all of these gorgeous hairs for adult sims I wish they would just make them for toddlers and kids as well because it's a bit you know me and <clears throat> I wish there would have been some more bracelets i guess because i think there's only one which is like this little uh looks like a they took palm tree leaves or something there's like leaves on it and that's it and you can't really use it apart from if you really live on the island i guess <laughs> and i haven't tried out mermaids yet but i feel like i might maybe um i played a bit yesterday and i was overwhelmed with how gorgeous the build and buy items are but if you want me to, let me know because then in my first build that's going up tomorrow, I can probably talk a bit more about what I liked or disliked about the build and buy objects because there's quite a lot to mention, I guess. Um, mainly positive though, so <laughs> let me know if you would like a bit of an honest overview because but I guess I'm very honest. So <laughs> that could be beneficial for you if you're thinking about buying the pack. Um, did you buy the pack? Let me know that as well. I'm interested in if you got the pack or if you actually don't want it or if you're waiting for it to go enough. And you know, that's totally understandable. No, everyone is like an addict like me and literally needs to get the game straight away when it comes out. <clears throat> I've actually pre-ordered it, which I always do. And then I got super excited because it was released at midnight, which I didn't think because I think the other expansion packs all got released at the same time but i might have been like i might be wrong let me know if you know that as well <laughs> that'd be great but anyways i really love how the sim turned out and i love that outfit i gave her for her sim version i guess <laughs> and if you enjoyed this video don't forget to leave a like comment and subscribe if you have not already and ring that little notification bell so you get reminded every time i upload a video and i'll see you guys tomorrow bye